Yeah, a really little bit bad luck, but still I think I played good match. Uh, we all did very good. Elena is a great player on grass, so yeah, I think it was a pretty interesting match. First set I was 5-1 up, and then I lost the set. Second set she was 5-2 up, and then I did a great comeback, but still. On the end she won the match, so yeah, I'm a little bit disappointed. Just how difficult was it to deal with losing the first set from such a commanding position? I think it was uh, pretty tough for me because uh, I was up 5-1, then 5-3 and 40-15. So it was very tough to start second set after I lost 7-5 first set. But still I had again chance the second set. I was again 2 love up and then 5-2 down. So it was it was pretty interesting match I would say. <laughs> What a fantastic week for you. Can you, you don't leave that disappointed because it's been an, such a, a massive week of growth on, on grass for you. Yeah, I think it was a very good week, so I can be very happy about it and I can look forward to play on Wimbledon Qualis. So I think I can be really happy about this week. A lot of people were talking about you after the match, just saying that you've got an amazing fighting quality. Have you always prided yourself on, on being a battler? I don't know what can I say because uh, I was really fighting this match until the end. But yeah, I hope I can fight like this always. You know, it's it's not always easy to fight when you lose uh, first set like this. But still, I got uh, power to fight until the end. Also, we've seen you uh, in the last probably six months absolutely rocket up the the standings, uh, up the rankings to 136 at the moment. What's been your secret? How have you you transformed yourself almost? I think I started to practice much more and I became more professional and uh, also yeah when you start to practice much more and then the results come you know so I think for me uh, it's it really like after these two weeks that I had of practice in December before I started the new season I think I prepared very well and then the results came. And for what it's worth you, you, you're still on tour, uh, you, you travel alone a lot of the time um, sponsorship and, and that sort of stuff as well, you don't have a lot of that. Just how is your tennis going at the moment and what are, what are your goals for the rest of the year now? Uh, yeah, I still don't have like any sponsors at all, just for rackets I have Yonex. Uh, but the rest my parents help me, so it's a little bit tough. But yeah, my goal this year is top 100, so I could play maybe next year or maybe already. Like for US Open main draw, I would be very happy if this would happen. So yeah, my goal is for sure top 100.